The core of the Dresden Porcelain Collection was assembled in the early 18th century by Augustus the Strong, Saxon elector and Polish king. He even dedicated an entire palace to porcelain, the Japanese palace. To this day, Dresden has the largest collection of Chinese and Japanese porcelain of the 17th and 18th century. What makes the Dresden Porcelain Collection unique is also its exceptionally rich historical documentation. Three Japanese palace inventories have been preserved, and the numbers in the inventories correspond to the numbers and symbols applied to the undersides of the porcelain. The aim of the Dresden Porcelain Project was to research these important historic holdings with a big group of international specialists. The digital catalogue of the East Asian Porcelain records the entirety of the historic collection for the very first time. In the beginning, when I was being asked to do this catalogue, I thought, I can't do this alone. And I have a good network in my field. So at first I asked my direct colleagues all over the world. So we, we organized a nice group of, of people who knew each other and uh, reflected on each other. We have created a digital platform, the Royal Dresden Porcelain Collection, which is tailored to the specific strength and interest of the Porcelan Sammlung's unique reference collection. For the first time, the Chinese and Japanese royal ceramic holdings from the collection of Augustus the Strong are published in conjunction with the historical documentation, the 18th century historical palace inventories. There are three kinds of catalogues. First, the scholarly catalogue. This catalogue is based on the established characteristics of catalogue raisonné and presents and contextualizes the latest research on the holdings with over 8,000 objects. The historical palace inventories publish the complete historical palace inventories of 1721 and 1779, and this will be presented for the very first time. And finally, the visualized inventories in this catalogue, the Porcelan Sammlung's extant object from the former royal collection are presented within the context of the historical inventory, creating in a very innovative new format an illustrated inventory. One of our most important pieces, the Dragoon Vases, can be traced to the um, historical inventory via the incised palace number. Carefully curated, the rich presented material will lead into new research and a new understanding of East Asian porcelain and its European reception in the Baroque era.